I wish certain words didn't exist in the English language. You know, like Andy. <laughs> now I hate everyone named Andy. I don't date anyone with a brother named Andy, and I sure <laughs> ain't sucking on any more Andy's candies <laughs> anymore. Mm -mm. Um, so I'm 30, three. And thank you, thank you, thank you. And single, you can clap for that too. Thanks. And I thought I was okay with that, but then I went to go look for an apartment. I was filling out the application, the landlady looked at me and she goes, you got husband, you got husband, you got husband, right? And I was like, no. You got boyfriend, you got fiance, right? And I was like, no. You're gonna be here alone, you're gonna live here alone, you got no nobody, you got no nobody, you got no Valentine! <laughs> and I was like, I get it, I get it, I get it, bitch. <laughs> I'm single, thanks. Yeah, no one prepares you for being alone and in your 30s. I mean, no one in sex ed told me that as women get older, we get hornier. All you 21-year-olds have so much to look forward to. <laughs> but now I understand why everyone gave me a vibrator for my 30th birthday. I just didn't think I'd have to use them all. Yeah. I mean, where's the life skills class? Where's the life skills class in dating in your 30s? Because there's a point on every date where pretending I'm not a mess <laughs> gets to be too difficult. <laughs> Being a whore is a lot easier. 